If you were looking for instructions on how to reset the waste ink counter on the Epson EcoTank 5800, then stay tuned, you won't want to miss this video. We're gonna be working with some software and some other items on a Windows computer, and I'll be showing you how to actually reset the waste ink counter. Hey, what's going on? It's the printer guy here, and if this video is helpful, please make sure to like. Any questions at all, comment below, and if you want more content like this, please make sure to subscribe. All right, so in order to do this, we're gonna to go to inkchip.net. There's going to be a link for this website Website down in the description below or you can simply type in inkchip.net you're going to go to the home page for WIC click on WIC and click English this is going to download the English software uh, that's going to allow you to actually reset the waste ink counter an application should pop up just like this you're gonna open that application and you can begin the process of downloading this software now of course you do need a Windows computer for this and you're going to extract all of the languages you're going to select English and once you've selected English you're going to have this application that pops up you're going to click on waste ink counter and you're going to select your specific uh, printer model for me it's the Epson ET 5800 and as you can see here there is certain percentages that have been used already you do need to connect directly with the USB cable from the computer whether it's a computer laptop to the printer uh, we're going to go back to inkchip.net and we're going to uh, click on WIC. This is where we can actually purchase a reset key. We only need one, so I'm gonna click on buy for the one WIC code. Make sure you use discount code best printers to save 10% on your purchase. You don't wanna miss out on that savings. Again, that's best printers. All the information uh, that I talk about here in this video is gonna be linked down in the description below. You can now proceed to checkout and you should receive an email where you will have an activation key or rather a reset key. Uh, that you can input here. So again, going back to the software, putting in the key and clicking OK. All right, so after you input the key, you should get a message like this done. Please restart the printer in order to finish the uh, counter reset process. At this point, you can reset the actual printer. Now, when we click on read waste ink counter, once again, you should see all zero, zero percent all the way through. And that will basically indicate that uh, your waste ink counter has totally been reset. Again, we used inkchip.net, use 10% off discount code best printers. And uh, this is everything you'll need to do in order to reset your waste ink counter on your Epson EcoTank 5800 model and similar printers. Thank you so much for watching until the end of this video. I handpicked two videos that are here on the screen for you to watch next. Also consider subscribing to this channel. There's so much helpful content for you if you're a printer owner, and it's just good to have a resource like this for you in the future, whether you're dealing with a printer that's not printing well or you need more printer recommendations. So I look forward to seeing you again in another video.